Hey, how's it going? Today I'll show you how to get an amazing alternative app store for your Fire Stick called AppLinked. Inside, you'll find thousands of apps from different categories, such as movies and TV, games, sports, utilities, and live streaming. Those are the apps that you cannot download from the official Amazon App Store by default. So, in other words, today I'll show you the easy way to jailbreak your Fire Stick device. The whole setup is going to be super easy and will take you only a couple of minutes. First of all, you have to get an app called Unloader. You can actually get it for free from the official Amazon App Store. To do so, we'll have to go to search on your device and here in a search bar, just start typing Downloader. Then, as you can see, Downloader already popped out for us at the bottom. So there was even no need to enter the whole name of the app. We click on Downloader. And that's the app which you need to get to your device. But after you get the loader, it's not over yet. We still have to set it up. So to set up the loader, we'll go to settings. Let's do it right now. Click on that button with the gear icon. Then we scroll down and go to My Far TV. Open it. And here you have to enable developer options on your device. But on some Fire Sticks, and especially on the new Fire Sticks, the developer options can be hidden by default. So if that's the case and you cannot find developer options anywhere, no need to worry, it's really easy to make them appear. Just go to About, select Fire TV Stick and here you will have to click on the middle button on your remote for 7 times and do it fast, so let's do it. As you can see, now at the bottom for me it says no need, you are already a developer. That's in my case. And in your case, it's going to say that you have become a developer now. So if we go back a bit, we will finally see developer options, which have appeared right here. So make sure to open them, enable ADB debugging here, then we'll need to go to install unknown apps, from here locate the loader and turn that option on. So what it does is going to allow you to install other applications from the internet and not necessarily only those apps which are only available in the official Amazon App Store by default. And that's exactly what we're going to do right now. So now, finally, let's go to the list of apps on your device. There it is, we open it. And here you will find the downloader application. But before actually using the loader, there's one more thing which I always recommend doing. It's of course connecting to a VPN. In my case, I mostly use NordVPN because they're super fast they got a great app for Fire Sticks, Android TVs, phones, laptops, or pretty much any other device you may use. And they are not expensive for such a premium service. In fact, they cost less than a cup of coffee per month, which is great pricing for us, the users. In a VPN app, you just connect to any server, and from the moment you connect, all your traffic is going to be totally encrypted. So let's say we will connect to Italy now. Let's wait a bit, and yep! We are connected now, just like that. And if you don't have a VPN yet, but you want to try it out, I do have a great offer for you. If you use my link, which will be in a pinned comment below the video or in the description of the video, you'll get three months of NordVPN totally for free, which is an amazing offer. And if you're watching this video on your TV or on your Fire Stick, then just grab your phone or your computer open up a web browser and go to topvpnoffer.com. That's my website, which is going to give you the same amazing deal for NordVPN, with 3 months for free. Or just scan the QR code, which you can see on the screen right now, with the camera of your phone. It works the same way, and it's also going to give you the same deal for NordVPN. And now, finally, let's use the loader safely. So we finally gotta go and open the loader. There it is. Let's open the application and now just wait until it loads for you. After that, on the left side menu, make sure to click on home and not on browser. So after you have clicked on home, we need to enter the search bar and from here we will need to enter a link. So let's enter it together. The link is going to be applinked.store. So once again, it's app linked. dot store. 
So here you go, you can see the whole link on your screen right now, make sure to enter it exactly as you see and do not make any mistakes, because obviously if you make a mistake, your link is not going to work. After that, we'll have to click on go and while the website is loading, make sure to subscribe my channel so you would get even more content about flower sticks, as well as please hit the like button below this video. It truly really helps me a lot and this way I'll be able to create even more videos for you. And now, after the website has opened, we just need to click on the download app linked button, which is located right here. So we click on it and in a couple of moments, the download for us is going to start. Usually it doesn't take long. Then you have to click on install and wait until the app linked application gets installed to your Flower Stick or your Android TV device. And after it's installed, do not click on open yet, instead press on done, because here we'll have an option to delete the installation files, as we don't need them anymore on our device. So click on delete and then delete once again. This way we get rid of unnecessary installation files from your Flower Stick and save you some free space on your device. And that's really important, because you don't really have too much of free space on your Flower Stick anyway. Now finally, let's go to the list of apps on your device, there it is. Scroll down to the bottom and here you'll find app linked, which we just unloaded. Now I would recommend you to click on the options button on your remote, that's the button with three horizontal lines. Click on it and then press on move to front. This way app linked is always going to be at the very top of your application list and therefore it's going to be super easy for you to access the app every time needed. Just don't forget to keep the VPN connected to stay safe and out of trouble. And by the way, there's one more thing we have to do in settings to make the app work properly. So let's go to My Flower TV again. From here, once again, we'll go to Developer Options, Install Unknown Apps, and this time we'll have to turn that option on for the app linked as well, because we want it to be able to download other applications from the internet. And now finally, when you open app linked, there it is at the very top, we open the app, have to accept the news, and from here you can basically go to all the app categories, such as live streaming, movies and TV shows, games, sports, utilities, or verified apps. Or you could just add any code that you found on the internet and use it within that app. So that was the easy way to get app linked alternative app store to your Fire Stick. Enjoy and see you next time. Bye-bye.